Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Goobies. I mean, I won't lie. I was very attracted to just the name and the art style and maybe one other thing, but we'll see. We'll see what that is. So we got Wiggle Woogle, one of my favorite, one of my favorites. He's a fun little guy. He's, he's just a little guy and he does Woogle. We got Dizzy Wizzy. He's, he's fun. Bingus Bongus. Yo, this is really, this is a game. I'll tell you what. So what do we got? I mean, yeah, it's a survivor's game. Um, I won't lie. It's, uh, I, <laughs> listen, I know, I, I know, listen, I know. Um, I saw this one. I'm like, you know what? It's got an art style. It's got, it's got a style. Let's see if it's got something else going on. Um, and right now all damage dealt was, a, has an additional 10% chance at critical. Oh, it really is just a survival game, isn't it? Oh, now I'm going to have to be very kind for like the next half an hour about this, um, despite my internal misgivings. Uh, <laughs> listen, I mean, if the devs of Goobies uh, end up on the watching this video, um, please understand. I've played a lot of these games now and um, uh, my general stance here, uh, I'm talking to everyone else, is that if it's got something to offer to the genre, something new, um, something I haven't seen a lot of times, then uh, by all means. But if it is just a skin, then I am going to... My, my cynicism is raised. Increase your movement speed. Increase your, the radius of all AoE items. One Dizzy's Ball remain, that shoots enemies dealing three damage. Okay, Dizzy Ball. We got a Dizzy Ball. Um... Right now, uh, uh, the way my main character moves around is really funky. It's, it kind of looks like a filter. Like it doesn't look like, I, I feel like it's supposed to look like the Slytherin, but it just kind of looks like a filter where they're just kind of like woobling a little bit. Attacks have a 5% chance to ex implode upon impact, drawing enemies and then stunning them for 0.5 seconds and dealing two AO. There's a lot of stuff going on in this one. Deal more damage the faster you move. In uh, increase your attack range. Dur gain one tranquilizing mass, which floats around you. Let's do this implode AoE. Yeah, I mean, like, even... I'm, I'm at the point now where even if a uh, survivor's game has, like, almost completely unique abilities, it almost doesn't matter because at the end of the day, it's still going to boil down to you're leveling up the animations like you're just um increasing the amount of animations on the screen until all of the red dots are gone they disappear you know attacks have a 20 percent chance to splinter three times upon impact dealing two damage each uh, enemies have a 15 percent ignite on aoe fire upon death dealing sure let's let's get that it's a numbers game this is a numbers game Press tab or middle mouse button to display your item and stats. Oh, cool. Okay. Um, we are just kind of moving with our mouse. And so therefore, this is a game you can play with just one hand. I, I don't know if that matters. But um, we can increase our fire AoE. Condensed power. Passive. Increases the damage of all AoE items by 15%. I mean, it's, it's highlighted blue. And so my uh you know it hits the dopamine button a little bit harder so i'm gonna do that i mean things are things are heating up right now pew 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 oh we got new enemy big old goober these ones explode do they actually do damage to other enemies frost bolt sonic howl citrine crumbs increase your attack speed sure I'm of the cons uh, of the mind that um, you don't really notice a, an addition, like a percentile increase of something, unless it's like at least 15%. So right now that attack speed isn't really doing much. Boomerang projectile. Attacks have a 10% chance to throw an art king boomerang dealing damage. Okay. Well, I will admit I am compelled by some of these abilities. They're pretty cool. I do still like the art style. 
um it's it's fun like it really is charming um i like kind of just like moving through these trees some of these aoe attacks are really starting to pop off now that oh we, we've got our first boomerang goobies honestly uh half the the you know entry fee is just, just being able to say i'm tell when you're telling <laughs> on your discord channel and your friend asks it, what are you playing i'm playing goobies just let them know every single time you're playing this game projectiles deal one more damage sure You know, we got we got a little pops, we got a little poops and pups and zips and zoops, and we do zoop and we wibble and we wobble. Pop pop. Ooh, that one's pink. Obliteration passive, dealing damage to enemies above 95% HP has a 20% chance to deal 25% of that damage again. We got some like really nested abilities here, and I'm not really sure how they relate. Like I'm not sure how that is going to work at all um i do feel like we get like diminishing returns when it comes to how complex an ability works um like you know this ability works 90 percent of the time 10 percent of the time 20 percent of the time eventually i just don't know if it works anymore i wouldn't necessarily say that's a criticism but i do will say that at a certain point um uh, like i don't know if that really is depth is a salvaged energy upon finishing a combo streak an explosion of energy erupts from within dealing damage equal to the combo streak well it's orange so i have to take it i don't know what when that happens like when do we complete a combo streak Okay, I think I think I just did like I think the combo streak is just like as long as we're killing things we're doing a combo I do a couple things I appreciate here um, I appreciate that the level is so limited Because I've mentioned this in my deep rock galactic survivor video is like it really does kind of bother me how large a lot the, the levels will be in these survivor games um, I appreciate when they limit it because it feels a little bit more thought. Um, and I don't, I feel like I don't have to just like move in one direction. Wow, that's a big boss um, for like 20 minutes. So we got bosses in this game. I, I, I honestly had no idea. And it does actually like do stuff. And that is a big gooby, I will say. Ooh. Yo, he be goobin. Don't be goobin on me, dude. Um, goo AOE. Attacks have a 15% chance to conjure one homing goo which seeks out an enemy in radius and then explodes in a small radius. A lot, of, a lot of stuff going on in this game. In, in specifically these abilities. You know, okay, um, I, I will say, uh, I am, my, my cynicism is being toned back. You know, it's like one of those little, like, uh, you know like a boss bar and it a in order to to chip away at the large spongy health of my cynicism uh it does need to take attacks in the form of innovation and something and i, I think this game's got some stuff going on i think at the end of the day it still feels like another survivor game but i think it is at least not feeling like yet another like it's been it's been leveled up from yet another to just another for now let's see let's see if it uh Continues to, you know, increases the damage of all AOE. You know, let's, con let's do that. I think uh, where I really draw a hard line is like, am I going to feel like I, I couldn't, you know, win? Um, unless I get some like in-between or meta regression. I guess I like, I, I, I'm not going to, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to talk about that again. Yo, he did explode into a bunch of goob. A ma'am foresees your existence. Has times two enhanced Dizzy's balls. <laughs> two Dizzy's balls that shoot enemies dealing three damage each shot that has a 30% chance of ricocheting. Dissolve. 
we can dissolve it for more XP. No, don't take it. Oh, look at that. It's actually really good. Look at that. Oh my god. What is that? It's a big goob. Oh! Oh, we are... We're in the desert now. I think. We are in a different level. It is at least a different palette. Chain. Your initial attack has a 25% chance to chain up to up to one up to one enemy dealing seven damage or pierce. Your initial attack will pierce enemies one time dealing 25% damage each pierce. Uh, let's take pierce. Oh, that's a new n new goob. Oh god, it explodes into many goobs. It's like one of those uh Oh, this is this is no one's going to thank me for this. It's like one of those videos of like the the spider that's got you know, it's it's got little babies on it. Kill it with violence. Oh, that was a nice chain reaction there. Oh, it's still going. Tree hugger. Hugging trees has a chance of releasing a cluster of up to 30 orbs of experience. Okay. That's a that's a new one. I haven't seen that one before. Let's go find some trees and hug them. I'm hugging these trees. Let's go find some other trees. I'm hugging them. I don't know how to hug them. I'm, I'm hoping that just like whooping around in them is uh, is good enough. Seems to me these enemies don't really know what to do about this, like, geometry. Which is highly working out in my favor, until it doesn't. And I can shoot through them. This is interesting. Um, Crushed Ruby... All damage dealt has an additional 17.5% chance to critical. Now let's take implode. I like this implode. Uh, I don't know if I'm hugging these trees properly. I guess I just did. I, I see. I saw that XP. Ghost blobs. Enemies have a 2% chance to convert into ghosts upon death for 5 seconds, dealing low damage to all nearby enemies. I feel like I should take fire AoE. Uh, this is also an AoE, okay. I am liking this. It's completely innocuous. Nothing really wrong with it. It's doing exactly what it needs to do. It's doing it well though. It's, you know, I like, uh, it, you know, it's fun. <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's, it's doing it. It's got some novelty. Uh, I feel like I haven't seen all of this like a thousand times before. Uh, attacks have a 15% chance to 17% chance to conjure two homing goos. Um, explode. Enemies have a 10% chance to explode on death, dealing six AOE damage. This seems to be. Oh, but then this also explodes. Let's uh, let's do increased chance. These AOEs are are doing well for me. Yeah, I mean, I won't lie. Uh, it really... Uh-oh. They're defending themselves somehow. These guys, these these big goobers, they've got, uh, they've got the big AoE splorts. Things are, things are becoming a little bit um, more. I can no longer hide amongst the trees. Um, yeah, let's continue with this goo AoE. Oh god, where where did you guys come from? It's like a little horde. Does this uh does the enemy's AoEs like hurt them? That doesn't seem to. In fact, it seems to like help them in some I don't know. It's it's a weird one. Oh, what is this? Spirit of Mumza. 
Attacks have a 1% chance to make you enter a frenzy during this period of time. Deal 20% bonus damage and move faster. Uh, how long does the frenzy last? Oh, God. I see dead blobs. Enemies have... Oh, this is just uh, the same one, but now I get to level it up to two. Increased odds of having ghost blobs. Ah, uh, this is... This game is good. It's good. I don't have to be kind out of... Uh, respect it's just a good game respect i mean like uh, you know what i mean i don't have to save face it's just a good game good i'm glad i mean i, I like i'm not you know completely ignorant i saw the screenshots i'm like yeah that's a, that looks like another survivor game but i i just have a feeling this one might be good and i think it is i mean i, I don't think this is going to be necessarily like the next potato i don't think that the you know, all the survivor... I feel like all YouTubers that went through the survivor phase... The sur vampire survivors were really the fidget spinners of YouTubers. You know what I mean by that? Like, it really was done. <laughs> um, so I feel like a lot of people are burnt out on survivor games. And have kind of settled on two or three. Uh, maybe maybe more. I know that some people still like, like to find new ones, but... I've never watched a scene like any YouTuber like that finds a new one, play it more than once or twice. Um, passive increases your damage. Well, yeah, let's just increase our damage. I'm a little bit worried about my health. I do actually want to continue playing this. I want to get to the next level. Ah, end of demo. <laughs> end of demo has a million health points. <laughs> Look at that, lad. Yo, he is a chunk. Does this mean... Wait, does this mean I can't progress past this? Or does this mean... I have to... Uh, it's just like a, a, a wall that the devs don't think I can surpass. Tree whisper, hugging trees is a chance of releasing a cluster of up to 50 orbs of experience and up to one ab arboreal gift. Well, heck yeah. How can I say no to arboreal gifts? I really do have to keep moving now, though. Um, unfortunately, those AoE shots just kind of make it impossible for me to hang out in this tree area, which kind of makes those tree hugging abilities um, not as good anymore. Uh, funny though that that uh, the boss has is very large but i get the impression that its hitbox is actually quite small because it seems to be able to sneak through that cliff area is it just like faster than me is there any way to actually run away from this i don't think there is i think i think this is really meant to yeah okay Okay. <laughs> when they said end of demo, they really meant it. Circle of self-control. You can now aim your shots. Oh, really? Interesting. Okay, so there are um, artifacts. I don't didn't mean to do that. I wanted to check out the artifacts. See if I could actually use them. Upgrades. Okay, I mean, this game's got upgrades. You all know how I feel about that. I wish it didn't really have this specifically. I think that it it's just good enough. It doesn't need this. I'm a little bit disappointed to see that it's got the, the in-between meta progression. Um, but I guess if... I, I guess if it didn't need it, then it's okay. But I don't know. I don't know. Can we try out... Oh, we can't try out Dizzy Wizzy. It's locked. To unlock Dizzy Wizzy, achieve a maximum combo of 1,000 or more. Bingus Bongus. To unlock Bingus Bongus, defeat Mumza a total of three times. I haven't defeated Mumza at all. Are there bosses, like, generate randomly random bosses? <laughs> I want, I want Hoozy Woozy. <laughs> achieve 825,000 in score in a single run. How do I achieve... I guess a lot of these are going to be, like... You can unlock them if you were actually playing the game and not the demo. I I am charmed by this game. I have reservations, but I actually think I would um, 
consider grabbing this on on release i'm gonna assume that this game is gonna be cheap when it comes out i mean that is the trend but i mean this is goobies i it's it's hard not to be charmed by it. it's got some interesting things going on and i mean it was fun i liked it if uh if you've tried goobies and uh you know let me know in the comments let me know what you think of it and if you've enjoyed this video definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this i'll see you guys next time take it easy